And Secretary Buttigieg, for you, um, President Biden has said the federal government should front the full cost of reconstructing the bridge. What do the early estimates say that cost will be, and how quickly can you get that money? We don't have uh, dollar estimates yet, but uh, we actually have uh, uh, provisions that allow us to begin releasing funding even while that is being determined. Uh, my understanding is, uh, as we speak this afternoon, a, uh, uh, an emergency relief funding request has come in from the Maryland State DOT. Uh, we'll be processing that immediately uh, to start getting them what they need. Uh, also, later today, there will be a design and procurement oriented meeting that we'll participate in, our Federal Highway Administration, along with MDOT. Uh, again, obviously, it's early days, uh, but uh, now is the time to begin scoping that out so that they can get to work. Thank you. Good uh, related to that, Mr. Secretary, um, how much is how much existing money is there now within DOT coffers to handle requests such as other one from MDOT? Um, is do you have funding through the uh, the Federal Highway Administration, uh, through the infrastructure law, or or when do you anticipate having to go to Congress for potentially a supplemental request on the bridge costs? So the infrastructure law did authorize funding into the emergency relief account, which is the mechanism that is most likely to come into play here. Uh, last I checked, there was about $950 million uh, available, uh, but uh, also a long line of needs and, and projects behind that. So it is certainly possible, uh, I would go so far as to say likely, that we uh, may be turning to Congress uh, in order to help top up those funds. Uh, but that shouldn't be a barrier to the immediate next few days beginning to get the ball rolling. What will be the time for him sending that stuff to I think it's too soon to, to know the mechanics of that.